Hey guys, welcome to the Blocky Podcast, or as we call it, the Blockcast. Bad name. Get out, next guest, come on in. Fine, I still don't understand why you're desperately trying to make a new show. Blocky's funny doing just on hiatus because of the perjury stuff, so we're just trying to get a new show greenlit. Well, a podcast just sounds lame. Okay, now you get out. Flower, come back. Yo, what's up? Well, that's why you're here. I'm curious as to how you are, Flower. Honestly, Blocky, pretty bad. We're both not exactly vote to save magnets. Either of us could be eliminated today. So I'm kind of stressing out. Uh, hello? Are you even listening? Haha, <laughs> that was a funny prank. Cause I didn't listen to you, right? It's a prank podcast. Ha <laughs> ha. Ha, <sighs> Flower's right, Woody. That idea sucked. We need to think of a new show. But pranks are the only thing I know. Psst. Hey, over here. Ah, uh, what's that coming from? The bush. Have not come on in here, guys. Oh, okay. Okay, uh, so we're just... I guess we're all going into the bush now? Wait for me, guys! Psst! I have not. Welcome to Cake at Steak! Did you get permission to... Purple Face, did you get permission to do Cake at Steak? Let's just say, yes, I did. <laughs> okay, so you clearly didn't. Bye! Here's a stick. This stick can be blocky for elimination. Anyway, time to make this feel like a normal cake at steak. I thought I'd sing a song. La la la, cake at steak. It's the time where we are all happy. And we have fun. Fun! If we get out, we fly into the sky and spin in circles for months. And it's super high up too. <laughs> Did I give you permission to interrupt me? No. Okay then, back to my song. In, in fact, I'll start from the beginning. <gasps> la, 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 cake, yeah. Where is everybody? Uh, uh, never mind, let's get on with this super quickly. We got a total of 57,729 votes. Fire, you're safe with 17,899 votes. Yay! Where's my cake? We keep not getting Lately. We don't have time for this. Here, uh, have a member of the have cops. <laughs> oh, hey, Teardrop. How? Oh, bye, Teardrop. Come out here now, or else I'm going to be mad. Woody is safe with 17,054 votes. Here's Lollipop. <laughs> uh, where are we right now? Please ask questions later. It's between flower and stick. I just know I'm out. Yeah, you're out. Sorry. No. Oh my gosh. I played the whole season wanting to redeem myself. I got out first last time and I got another chance, but I still came up short. I wanted to prove everyone wrong again. Round 24 again. I'm so humiliated. Yeah, sorry, stick. Oh, wait. You're Flower? Mm. I got you confused with Stick for a second. Oh, no, no, no. Flower, you're safe with 11,547 votes. Stick got 11,229 votes. Another close battle. No way! I did it! Let's party, Stick! Here's Leafy. <laughs> From out of my mouth. Thanks for ruining the moment, purpley head. <laughs> no worries. Oh, wait. That wasn't a genuine thank you, was it? And what did you call me? You're all still in here? What happened? Sorry, Blocky. You're out of the game. What? But I'm like the star of the show. <laughs> It'll be all right, Woody. Just make sure to pull some pranks while I'm gone. Whoa. Wait a second. I was on my way to jet flying class. Good one. How dare you! If anyone else is suited to do pranks around here, it's you, Woody! I may be out of the game, but I think I found the new star of my show! Hey guys, for a break! Go, Woody! Now, go up to examine someone's fashion line! Oh, another interesting customer! Are you planning on getting anything 
Woody. <laughs> what will it be? You want all of it? I'll empty my biggest sail yet. And destroy it all. Oh, I see. You're putting it down there for later. Is he coming back? He's not coming back. <laughs> Pretty funny. This program was brought to you by Blocky Presents Woody's Funny Doings International. What's going on? Where is everyone? Uh, they're around? I guess. I don't know. Wait, Teardrop, what are you doing? Ah, uh, Teardrop! <laughs> from me, are you? Four, Purple Face did the cake and steak, and I got the least votes, so I'm out of the game. Purple Face did what? Just beat me up already. Fine, whatever. Make me proud, Woody! Ah! Give me a second, I'm just gonna despawn Purple Face for doing cake and steak. Okay, I'm back. I'm angry the elimination got taken away from me. I want my big moment for the episode, so I've decided to make a big announcement. Final seven. Reaching the final seven means a new stage in the battle. You're merging. <laughs> Hooray! Congratulations, final seven. There are no longer teams. You'll be competing for individual immunity. We're close to the end of the game now. Right. Thanks for taking my other big piece of news. Huh, we took your news. Come over here, Purple Face. Just a second, everyone. I'm despawning Purple Face again. Okay, I'm back. I'm really bummed out. You all took my big moments. The cake and steak and the merge announcement. So I've decided to be selfish. You all have to cheer me up. Today's challenge is to throw me a party. You'll each be given a patch of ground and a wall to decorate and put cool things on. You have one hour to put together the best party on Earth. And the creators of the best two parties will win immunity. Plus an additional twist will be announced later. And another twist for the episode. I'll be judging them. No, you will not. Oh, okay. Never mind. That twist is not happening. I'll just say it now. The twist is that the winning player gets to give another player immunity too! How exciting! Anyway, party time! And now it's time for the intro! Flower, go behind me so you can use your hand and lift it into the air. Uh, okay then. Yay! Yeah. Have you guys seen Teardrop? She's been kind of violent lately. Huh. No, I haven't seen her. I'll let you know if I do. What are you thinking of doing for the party, Lollipop? I don't believe in this disingenuous, forced celebration. I might make a terrible one on purpose. How about you? Hmm, just something with a lot of numbers everywhere, I guess. I'm struggling to think of what four would even enjoy celebrating. Like, if this was a party for me, I'd love some good cheesecake. Maybe a game of musical chairs, and there'd have to be forks everywhere for sure. Right, but would four like any of that? Yeah. Probably not. I might just, hmm, go with a different angle. Maybe Four would appreciate me making a party for the right-hand friend, X. What are you gonna do, Teardrop? Oh, Gelatin, just letting you know, Teardrop is right there. Right here. Next to us. She's right there. Been there the whole time, I think. Yep, thanks, Lollipop. Teardrop, to be honest, like, I know we've had a back-and-forth banter, but, like, you drew me getting killed in your pirate comic. And then you actually killed me inside Purple Face, and then you just whipped me into that bush? I'm just feeling a bit uncomfortable right now. Can you just leave me alone for a bit? Thanks, TD. Aw, I feel kind of bad for her. Hey, Fiery! Not now, Leafy, we're talking. Uh, alright then. 
Hey, Lizzy, if you want to hang out with me, I'm planning to go to my four petal sage shop to get some party supplies. Uh, sure, Flower, let's do it. Ooh, where are you guys off to? Honestly, Fiery, like, why didn't you stand up for me back there? I know I apologize for all that happened, but you never apologized to me for ignoring me for years. And you're still contributing to that, you know? Oh, Leafy, I didn't even think about it. I know. I'll talk to you later. Ha. Ah. All right, Woody. You're filling in for the role of Blocky now. I'm trying to make a disaster of a party for four, so I need a suggestion on the worst music I could possibly play for the event. Hello! Hello! Great idea, Woody. Purple Face, I need your beautiful singing voice for a party I'm throwing. Sounds great! How far away is your store anyway, Flower? Well, it's not exactly the most successful store. They say location matters, and unfortunately it's pretty difficult to get to. But here we are, at the quicksand of death. Uh, what are we doing here? Going inside! Come on in, Leafy! Let's go! Wait, what? Someone help! Wait! X, I need to know, what are your favorite things, like hobbies and stuff? I like baskets! Cool. Anything else? Uh, I guess not. Hey, Flower! What's underneath this pit? Oh, the 1,000 foot drop of doom! The, the, the what? <gasps> Do you like this banner I made for the party, Woody? It says, Happy Halloween! It's the wrong time of year for it! Might even wear a costume, too. Say, what are you making? <laughs> Whatever that means, I'm sure it's great. Good luck, Woody. <laughs> Finally, we're at the bottom. Now what? We just need to cross the 50-mile tightrope and then we'll be at the shop. Grrr! Hey, Fiery. I'm all done with my X-Theme party. How's yours going? Hmm. I think I'm gonna end up losing a challenge. And, uh, I think that's okay. I, uh, really want to win immunity, but I wanted to do something nice for Leafy. I'm just making her a gift instead. Really? For Leafy? Did something happen between you two back in the courthouse? Because we never did find out who stole the diary. Nothing major. I just feel like Leafy's been trying really hard, and her efforts should be rewarded. Huh. I mean, if you can forgive her, I guess I've got nothing to be mad at. Need a hand making the gift? Thank you! Yes, you can do a test run of it. Finally, we're here. I kind of expected a mega store, not a stand. I know, Leafy. It's not the most expensive store, and it might be in a bad location, but it's something I'm passionate about. And I care about it a lot, so it's worth it to me. Hey, boss. What do you need today? Not too much. Just some supplies for a party. Oh, I have some party supplies. Here's some. No, oh, thank you. And some more. Yeah, thanks. That should be good. Ah, oh, you want more? Here's some more. This is weird. Oh, you want more? Here's some supplies. More, more, more. We have enough. This is good. But we don't want the party to be good. We want it to be great. Here's some more. Oh my gosh, Leafy. Let's get out of here. Run! Wait, let me come with you. Leafy Flower Invested Coin. I'm the third of our funny trio. We'll go down in history. Leave us alone. So, Purple Face, how's the song coming along? Uh, I'm trying to rehearse my song in peace. Seriously, how annoying. Wow, you're very rude. Perfect for this party, then. Time is nearly up. We're back. Quick, Leafy, don't make your party! There isn't any time! I'll just help you with yours! Okay, Leafy, if I win the challenge, I'll give you the extra immunity! Thanks, Flower! Just toss the boxes at the wall! The decorations will automatically attach! It'll be good enough! Oh! Oh! You weren't lying, Flower! That looks great! Alright, everyone! Time to sing the parties you all made for me! We'll start with you, Gelatin! Let's see your party for me! You got it! For my party, I decided to make one for X! 
But the parties are meant to be for me. I thought I'd think outside the box a little. So I made a very basket-heavy party to appeal to X. You drink out of mini baskets. The seats are baskets. I didn't really have much to work with. Ah, how lovely of you to make a party for X. And you use things that X loves too. What a sweet party. Zero out of ten. Because the party was meant to be for me. All right, Fiery. How about your party? For my party, I decided to make a Ferris wheel with a fun special part. <sighs> it has a lava fall, but once half a rotation has gone around, it triggers the Ferris wheel to drop water down instead. <laughs> and then the switch is back and forth every time half a rotation has gone around. That way, Leafy and I can both ride on the Ferris wheel together. I hope you like it, Leafy. Wow, Fiery, what a wonderful gift. I'm sorry I pushed you away for so long. Just because I was mad didn't give me permission to be mean and cold to you. Thank you for saying that, Fiery. And this Ferris wheel truly means a lot to me. Wanna go for a ride? Sure. Wait, but that has nothing to do with me. I know, I didn't focus on winning the immunity. Grr. Two out of ten. The Ferris wheel is cool, I guess. How about you, Leafy? Show me your party before you go off and ride this thing. Oh, I didn't make one. Sorry, your foreigner. I just helped Flower make her party. Bye. <laughs> Leafy gets a zero out of ten. So that's three parties out of seven so far. And none of them were made with me in mind. This has not improved my mood at all. Woody, let's see your party. Oh, oh, huh? Oh, you want me to translate for you? Okay, I can do that. Hey guys, Woody here. For a prank, when it's someone's party, throw a party for someone else entirely. In this case, I made a party for Purple Face. There's posters of Purple Face everywhere. Sweater candies which appeal to him. And best of all, additional sweaters he can wear when he stretches his last one beyond repair. Oh my gosh! So you did retrieve them from the bottom of the cliff. Hooray! This party has nothing for likes at all. Pretty funny. This program was brought to you by Blocky Presents Woody's Funny Doings International. So I hated that. But I guess I do find Purple Face kind of funny, so... One out of ten for you. Flower, show me your party. Okay, I actually did one for you, Flower. It's a bit basic, I guess. But with my good friend Leafy, I was able to decorate the wall with some beautiful party supplies. There's tons of glitter. And best of all, all the supplies repel vomit. In case Purple Face comes as a guest. Why does so much of your merchandise repel vomit? Eh, uh, whatever. I appreciate that it's a party for me. So, you'll get a 5 out of 10. Pretty okay. Two job, you're up. And this clearly isn't for me. Again. <gasps> I'm sorry, gelatin. Ooh, there's cheesecake, my favorite. No way. Musical chairs, so rad. Forks, oh my goodness. And you made a comic for me too? Gelatin spacewalk? Whoa, this is so cool. Thank you so much, Teardrop. I know I was mad earlier. I like messing around with you. Let's just keep it at being silly and not violence. All right, buddy? Hooray! Thank you so much, Teardrop. And you guys stop using your parties as a way to fix your own personal conflicts and just base your lives around me, please. One out of ten for Teardrop. Right now, Flower is guaranteed immunity due to having the top result with one contestant left. Fiery could come second with his Ferris wheel, unless Lollipop is able to top it. Huh, fat chance. Take a look at this for. Happy Halloween, buddy. Oh, wait, I've got a costume prepared. I am the Scribble Girl. What do you think? I've also got a. Ugh, I don't even want to admit to buying this stuff. A bunch of yellow face warehouse spoons. I use them to decorate the party. And finally, I had Purple Face prepare you a song. Take it away, Purpley. For, for, I love you so much. You are such a cool little number. And your face is... Kind of weird too. So far, did I come in last or what? Yeah, you came last in the losing competition because you win! <laughs> 10 out of
Hamilton. How did you know my favorite holiday was Halloween? Well, that song was so good. I do have a weird face. Thank you so much, Lollipop. You saved the day, and I feel great. I feel like I could fly for hours. Hooray! What? So, Lollipop and Flower, you have won immunity. And now for the twist. Lollipop! Since you won, you can choose one other player to have immunity. I'm gonna have to keep my newbie alliance in the game. Gelatin, you get immunity, buddy. Thanks so much, Lollipop. Which means that fiery leafy teardrop and Woody are up for elimination. This is the part where you, the viewer, cast your vote. Who deserves to stay? Type their letter in square brackets and post as a comment. And if you want to see the result when the next episode comes out, do not forget to subscribe by hitting the subscribe button. Oh, you're already subscribed? Thank you so much. Sorry, that was my AI clone speaking, because I've been working really hard on my new project. My name's Michael, and for over 10 years, I've been animating BFDI. I want to help you get better at Adobe Animate, so I started making a video course. It's called Object Animator's Toolbox, where I teach you cutting-edge techniques explained more thoroughly than anywhere else online. So much of what I've learned has been from books I've bought over the years. If you want to invest in your skills as an animator, I promise you Object Animator's Toolbox is worth it. Also, did you notice? Gelatin has a new voice actor, Ian. It's been amazing working with Graham Taylor for over eight years. He's one of the best voice actors we've ever worked with. He's moving on to the next stage of his career, and I'm excited to see what he does next. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in BFB 25. Guys, a new episode of Woody's Funny Doings came out. Well, Leafy, we've been on this Ferris wheel for like eight hours now. Wow, really? To be honest, I feel like I could stay up here forever. Me too. Funny doings, international. I knew he'd be great at it. That was pretty legit.